welcome back to Shy Girl Weight Loss. How have you guys been? Um, it's been an interesting couple days and I'm still on the same diet. Um, I'm hoping that this diet works because I enjoy the diet. It's not too much work for me and I still get to enjoy the foods that I love. So let's talk about what I ate yesterday. So I had a lot of banana smoothies because I love them and they keep me happy. <laughs> and then I also had my one meal of whatever I wanted and what I chose to have was two Pop-Tarts. I also had fish, um, cabbage, a pierogi, one pierogi, and one piece of bacon. So I had a multiple thing, so I can, like, I can't have too much of anything. So I just had like variety of things, and I was I was fine. And then I had a bana another banana smoothie at night. So it, I usually eat around four thirty till about seven thirty, around that time is when I choose one meal. So it's not that I'm eating that whole time. It's just I usually eat in that time frame so it's been working for me so um, yeah so I'll see if it helps me lose all of the weight that I want I also have plans to exercise but I don't know how to get started I know I want to start very light I'm thinking sit-ups push-ups and squats and just doing a very small amount of them maybe five and then slowly doing more and more over time um, just to start out uh, I want to work out in the house before I start going to the gym but I would love to go to the gym and really get the weights going and everything the treadmill I've never done had I've never had a membership to a gym so I think that would be a very nice experience for me so the other day I was talking about the most addictive foods. So I've been using um, social media to find these different charts and things about weight loss. And this is one that I found. It's called the most addictive foods. Now, tell me you guys if these are some addictive foods for you. Pizza, chocolates, potato chips, ice cream, cookies, french fries, cheese, Popcorn, bacon, cake, soda, and cheeseburgers. Are these addictive to you? The most addictive ones for me are pizza, chocolate, potato chips, ice cream. Okay, most of them. But the very most would be cake. I love cake. If I start eating cake, it gets bad. Like It continues on for a while. Um, cookies, like Oreo cookies dipped in milk. Oh, I love them. Golden Oreo cookies dipped in milk. And ice cream, especially ice cream with cake. Oh, I love pizza. I can finish the whole thing. Like, oh my goodness. Bacon, not so much. Um, I like, I did eat a bacon, but I can really eat one bacon and be fine. It's not, I don't get over with bacon. And soda, not really either because... Um, I don't like soda, so not at all. But everything else on this chart, if you guys can see, can you see it better now? Everything else on this chart is very addicting. So let's stay away from those, these, you guys. <laughs> all right, so let's get into it. How much weight did I lose the last couple of days? Um, so I'm going to show you this chart, this part. So remember last time I came in with to you guys, it was on the 2nd and I was 139.4 and I lost one pound that day. The next day I lost no weight. I lost one, I was still 139.4 on the dot, the same exact weight that I was the day before. So I lost nothing. Now yesterday, even with all the foods that I ate, I went down to 138.0. So I lost 1.4, right? Yeah, 1.4 pounds. So that is great. Um, it's still going great. I'm still enjoying it. I'm feeling fine. I'm not 
fasting for a whole day. Some people fast for days. Um, I haven't done that because I feel like if I fast for a whole day, I'm going to eat like crazy the next day. So the fact that I can eat what I want at least once a day and keep this going, it's been working for me. Like I said before, around the 138, 137 mark, I tend to start eating like crazy because it's like, oh, it's not so bad. You know, I'm not 143 anymore. I'm not in the 140s anymore. So now I can eat. Um, hopefully I don't do it this time, especially with you guys keeping me accountable. So I'm really enjoying documenting this on YouTube because it's keeping me wanting to show. Like I want to show that I'm progressing and um, I want to show that I'm not going back up. So I think that's really going to give me the accountability that I need in order to finally get this weight off so we can do this you guys keep at it keep up the good work and have a nice day